Hey guys, Vimal here and welcome back to my channel. First of all, wishing everyone a very happy new year. It's gonna be like an awesome year guys. Lots of amazing things happening and also amazing videos will be coming. So stay tuned to the channel. Anyways, our first video of the year, right? It had to be special and that's why I thought, chalo, I'll show you my brand new car that we took delivery just two or three days ago. You people saw the delivery vlog as well, right? It's our brand new Mahindra XUV 700 and in that video, a lot of people commented saying, Vimal, why don't you show the car? Give us a walk around and talk about the specs and features which variant did you take and also about the pricing details and basically that is what i'll be doing in this video i'm like super excited guys so as i've told you car is mahindra's all new xuv 700 and it's a beast guys i mean look at this it's got like an amazing road presence and it's available in different colors we actually went with the white variant and actually it looks very sporty i mean look at the whole design over here you've got black elements black accents right sort of looks like a dual tone edition car and gives you that sport sort of vibe and if you talk about the front look here's how it looks like guys you've got this beautiful Mahindra's new updated logo twin tail design it actually looks very nice from the previous logo and also look at the whole grill design over here guys gives you that macho sort of feel love this front profile on this car and if you talk about the color as I've told you this is called as the Everest white and man look at these new headlights over here uh, these headlights on this car are like super bright guys full LED DRLs you're getting and on top of that the car also comes with like cornering headlights that means you know headlights turn you know along with your steering wheel that is a very useful feature i would say and you're also getting like auto booster headlamps guys which automatically switch on after crossing a particular speed limits and in our particular variant you're also getting fog lamps and talking about the variants for to talk about this so xuv 700 is actually available in four different variants base model is mx then you get ax3 ax5 and top variant is the ax7 ours is the top second variant ax5 thing is now we actually wanted to go for the ax7 only and there's also a special luxury pack variant also available above ax7 but unfortunately ax7 or ax7l was not available guys there's like a huge waiting period for that model uh, the company guys showroom people were saying it's almost like one and a half year and you know we didn't have patience to wait that long that's why we went and took whatever was available and which is ax5 and good thing is this particular variant was covering most of our feature list and also our requirements and that's why i thought chalo let's go ahead with this purchase so we are done with the front profile right and talking about the engine variants so xuv 700 is available in two different variants you get a petrol a m stallion engine and also a diesel m hawk engine 2.2 liter this one is a 2 liter petrol engine guys and has like crazy power under the hood almost produces like 190 200 horsepower and it's like awesome guys i can say it's like a rocket guys once you step on the pedal now there's no stopping that is what i can say and here's how the side profile looks first of all the thing that you'll notice over here are these beautiful flush door handles guys look at this just a click of a button and there you go door handle opens up and comes out like this and talking about the safety rating xuv 700 is five star global encap rated right so that is one added benefit built quality over here is very solid is what i can say and man look at these tires also guys wheels you're getting like 17 inch diamond cut alloy wheels on the ax5 variant you'll get like 18 inch on the ax7 variant guys and also beautiful looking design is what i can say and here's how the rear profile of the car looks like you're getting a rear defogger rear wiper is also there you're also getting a spoiler over over here and coming to the tail lights guys so initially during the launch time right mahindra was giving sequential turn indicators but later due to chip shortage they actually removed that sequential turn indicators from all of their variants up to ax7 so I, that is one thing i miss over here but apart from that you're getting like a regular blink turn indicators and look at the xuv 700 badging guys very beautiful i love this logo design over here and on the bottom right you're getting two parking sensors on all the variants of xuv 700 i wish they would have given at least three parking sensors but TK there they were doing a fine job not an issue and there is no camera on xuv 700 ax5 variant guys you're getting cameras only on the top variant but that is not an issue uh, the dealers guys you know showroom guys are only fitting rear cameras at their place only but for an additional charge so that i'll be getting done very soon now go 
going to the left side over here, you've got the Adrenox badging and this is your fuel lid which opens up simply by a push of a button and there you go we've got the petrol cap over here and mind you the car should be unlocked then only this will come out so what i'll do is i'll just quickly hop in and i'll show you all the interiors and all the main highlights and you know features of this car and boys welcome to my xuv 700 Oh boy, look at the whole design and feel over here. I absolutely love this new steering wheel. Very sporty sort of vibe. You also get like a flat bottom over here. And look at these accents. You're getting like silver accents, glossy accents. And on the left of the steering wheel, right, you get like all your music controls. Volume control is there. Seek is there. Answer, end call. All of these options are available. There's nothing on the right side of the steering wheel. MID controls are present on the bottom dashboard over here. Using these buttons, you can easily access the MID. Here's how the key looks like guys i forgot to show you the key i actually put on an accessory cover over here so i'll give you like a closer look at the key later part and this one is your regular key guys only the top variant comes with like a uh, keyless push button start thing so here this is everything is manual let me just put in the key and turn it on and show you how the display on it looks like That looks pretty cool, right? So you're getting like a Mercedes style complete display from over here till the end of the dashboard. So it's actually two displays over here. Both of them are 10 inches and this one is your touch screen and it's got like all feature loaded is what I can say. You're getting wireless Android Auto, wireless Apple CarPlay and also ton of other features with integrated maps and navigation is also available. And here's how the center console looks like. You've got your AC controls. You're getting a manual AC over here. Your, this is your temperature adjust and lots of other features. Passenger airbag on off is also available. And talking about the gearbox, as I've told you, it's available in both automatic and manual variants. We went ahead with a manual because, you know, manual is the way to drive a car, guys. That is what I believe. And this one is a manual six gear gearbox so we'll talk about all of these in our full review video guys this is just like a walk around and you know quick tour of my car and apart from that i've told you right everything is like smart over here you also get like alexa integration in this car you just need to say alexa uh, open sunroof any command like that and alexa will do it and look at this sunroof over here guys massive panoramic sky roof is what i can say and looks absolutely gorgeous so this was something very uh, you know necessary most important feature we were looking for on a car and this particular variant was covering it so we went ahead and bought it alexa close the sunroof okay pretty awesome right and talking about the speaker setup, uh, AX5 variant comes with like six speakers on board. You're getting two tweeters, four speakers in four doors. And audio quality on it was actually pretty good, guys. You know, we've been driving it for the last two days and audio quality was pretty fine. We were enjoying it. So that is pretty much it guys, a quick walk around and tour of our brand new car. It's still a very new car guys, only been like two days. There are so many things I have to explore on the inside with the MID, the display and everything. So it's going to take some time, you know, at least 10 to 12 days. I got to spend with this car, then I'll be able to share my experience, feedback and you know, initial impressions and my thoughts about this particular car. So I hope you all enjoyed watching this video so far. And if you have any sort of questions, you want to know anything about this car, let me know in the comment section. And I'll definitely cover that so that's it i hope you all enjoyed watching this video make sure to smash that like button and subscribe to my channel for more such awesome videos and i'll see you all in my next one